On Friday, July 12th, Ty Lawson reported for camp. No, not Nuggets camp, but his very own skills camp at Rock Canyon High School for all kids ages 6 through 17. Oh yeah, it's fun. You know, um, it's not like most camps. You know, we have like different type days, wacky Wednesdays. Uh, today's supposed to be neon, neon Friday. So you know, it's interactive and make the kids you know have to interact with each other. And we had a uh, twin, twin Thursday. So you know, they're talking to each other about what uh, outfit they're going to wear, but also you learn how to play basketball, and it's, it's just it's fun. Ty Lawson has already had a chance to meet and spend some time with Brian Shaw, and he says he is impressed with the new head coach. A lot of time. We talk about everything. You know, I, we talk for probably about two to three hours, you know, one day, and uh, just talk about everything, about just life, basketball, just, you know, how things were in L L.A., how things were in Denver before you got here, just everything. You know, I, I like him. He's a player coach, just like everybody says. Lawson also had a chance to reflect on his now former teammate, Andre Iguodala, who has signed a four-year contract with Golden State in free agency on July 5th. Mixed emotions, you know, I kind of, you know, I was disappointed. You know, he, I felt like he was uh, one of the big pieces we needed to come back to still contend, you know, and be where we were last year. And, uh, he brought a lot to the game from, you know, defense, defense standpoint, playmaking standpoint, and uh, just overall, you know, uh, just re ready to play the game. So, you know, I, I was, it, it was kind of hurtful. I mean, hard for him to see him to leave and, uh, and go to Golden State. Ty Lawson also gave final advice to young players attending his camp. So if you have a goal in mind, just, just work hard towards it and uh, you know you can accomplish it. With Fox 31, I'm Dan Miller.